Is it this okay, guy? I want to change gears. Gentlemen, what is the, the most underreported story the Western media failed to cover? In my mind, it was Yemen, the tragedy there. Adam, what's your thought? I think that Yemen is obviously very underreported criminally so, but I would say in terms of the longer um, the, the longer um, implications of geopolitics, it would be the election of Duterte in the Philippines. Mm. He's shifted the domestic policies away from the American hegemony, and he's also shifted closer to China, possibly closer to Russia. I think he's going to be an extremely important player in Far East politics, and I think that he and Trump will have some difficult negotiations to get to. Yeah, well, if, Dima, if that is, if, if there is, well, well I, I, this will be a very interesting test for uh, mm. Trump, I suppose, because he says he doesn't want to support forced regime change. I'm sure there are plenty of people in Washington that would love to see the Philippine president go. Underreported well, story. That's true, uh, but I think that it's one underreported story. The other important underreported story is that today there is a meeting on the ministerial level between the representatives of Russia, Pakistan, and China yeah. on the Afghan settlement. Russia more and more often now uh, acts in crisis places of the world together with ca countries like Iran, Pakistan, and not with the West, because the West is becoming hopeless as a peacemaker. That's a very important trend very of the 2016. Mm -hmm. Three unreported stories. Yemen, the U.S. and Saudi invasion and mass murder of people in that country to try to reinstall their puppet uh, in control of that country. Completely unreported. The hypocrisy uh, compared to Syria is breathtaking. Uh, the end of the oil wars yep. between uh, Russia and Iran and Saudi Arabia. And who won that one? Uh, I, I'm not going to say any, someone won, but Saudi Arabia blinked first. Their economy is bankrupt. They've agreed to oil cuts. Russia is the one who survived with a relative, uh, you know, uh, stagnation, really, not even a real recession. Uh, and uh, Russia's economy is set to improve in the, in the years going forward. The third one, big unreported all the time, is climate change. Right now, the temperature inversion of the Arctic pushing cold weather down. Everyone in the first world sees colder weather. They say, oh, there's no global warming. It seems a crisis. Uh, intentionally designed uh, to lull us into not taking action until it's far too late, which and, it probably already is. And Mr. Trump doesn't seem to be interested yes. in it. Dima, 